Hi, this is Griffin with Wayson Furniture. Today we're going to be building the Better Homes and Gardens A-Cube Organizer. This is our tobacco oak finish and it can be found on walmart.com. Before you start, you want to check that none of your panels have any damage and they evolve your hardware. If you have any issues, you can refer to the number on the front of the manual and we'll take care of any of those problems that you have. If everything is in order, you can begin assembly. For step one, you need 18 plastic dowels, your four D panels, and two C panels. Start by inserting four plastic dowels into one of the D panels. Then insert only two plastic dowels into the remaining D panels. Next, insert four plastic dowels into each of the C panels. For step two, you need four cam locks and your E panel. Insert the cam locks into the E panel so that the little arrow points outwards towards the pre-drilled hole on the side. For step three, you need four cam bolts in your two B panels. Screw in two cam bolts into each of the B panels in these middle two pre-drilled holes. For step four, you're gonna need a D panel with two plastic dowels, a C panel, a D panel with four plastic dowels, your E panel, your D panel with two plastic dowels, your, another C panel, and then another D panel. Start by attaching this D panel to the C panel. And then this C panel to the other side. And then the E panel. Then this other D panel. And then a C panel. And then your D panel. For step five, you're going to need your two B panels. Attach them to the structure and secure them using the cam locks on this middle panel. To tighten a cam lock, simply turn clockwise. For step six, you're going to need your two A panels, eight screw bolts, eight caps, your safety strap, this small screw, and a washer. Start by attaching the A panel to either side. And then secure it with four screw bolts. process on the other side. After you have attached both your A panels, um, find which side these cam locks are on and on the opposite side, so this side, attach the safety strap. This will be the top of the unit. So take this small screw and the washer, insert it through the safety strap, and then 
screw the safety strap onto the unit.